This place blows. I can't believe we're stuck here all week. My bed is short and wide. You're sleeping the wrong way. Hey, it's a message from home. Start streaming this video. Oh, thank God, some contact with the outside world. Hey, that's my room. Hey, Steve, remember how you said I couldn't go to space camp? Well, check it out, you smug little bastard. Five strippers are living in your room, and they're totally horny. Melinda, Allison, go! Ooh, they're kissing where we practice kissing. We gotta get home. We gotta break out of this place. See you in hell, Okay, girls, pillow fight! Oops, forgot I put some sodas in there. Ladies, six of the ten richest men in America made their fortune off of dry cleaning or other businesses. So let's get in there and make some money! Oh, man, landlord gave me the wrong key. Jackass coked up Armenian. It's all right. We can do what we want. It's our door. This is not our dry cleaners. I think we're a block over. Go, 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 go! Girls, I don't understand. Why don't we have any customers? Well, sometimes it takes a while for a business to get going. Like when Bosoms opened up. No one went to Bosoms, right? And now people go to Bosoms. Mm-hmm. <gasps> oh, hi. Sorry. Are you still hoping number zero? Because I'm next. I'm one. What do you want, Haley? I just wanted to give you a store warming present. A bag of my mulch. It's filled with crap. Just like you. Now that is funny enough for you to leave on. So how's business? Great, look at all the clothes we have. Okay, I'm gonna explain this one more time. I bought the clothes and spruced up the store so it would look like we have customers, thus attracting real customers. What is so hard to understand about that? The other girls get it, right, Deborah? <laughs> I'm hungry. Come on, we need to make this work. For God's sake, I bought a floor-length chinchilla here. Maybe we should all just go back to stripping, like Tanqueray. Wait, Tanqueray's doing what? She felt bad your business was failing, so she went to the strip club to make your money back. No, no! If she goes back to stripping, then I failed, and Haley was right not to listen to me. I can't let that happen. Hey, has Stan tried to rape either of you guys yet? No. no. That's weird, right? Is Tanqueray here? Oh, no. She worked this afternoon, but now it's ladies' night, so she went home. Wow, your voice is sweet. Yeah, my gonads are tucked inside my abdomen. I was born with what doctors call bashful testicles. Oh. Hello? Stan, we just got a call from the bank. They say we haven't paid our car payment or the mortgage. Is this because you sunk all our money into the dry cleaners? Well, let's look at the positives here, Francine. I could have been born with bashful testicles. You tell the bank to think about that. You! With the 60-inch chest! How hairy are you? What? Uh... Damn it, I don't have time for you to estimate! Yes! You're perfect! I had three dancers cancel on me. How'd you like to make $600? A day? An hour! Tax-free, all cash. I really can't... cash? If you're having money problems, this could be your possible solution. What do I do? Now gyrate! Come on, shake it! Yeah, you're a natural! Now rip my pants off! Do it! Now kiss me! What? I said get out there! Protect yourself, Victor. You can't take another heartbreak right now! business going, sweetie? Well, I'm not doing as well as I thought. Once I paid all my costs and taxes, I'm barely breaking even. Well, look, maybe you should forget about all those starving kids you let down and think about how long you've been single. Mom, join a gym. Check it out. I'm back. Bam! Told you the dry cleaning business would be a success. My advice is so good, even strippers can benefit from it. Bong! Zing! This is all from dry cleaning? That's right, baby. We turned it around. Francine, I found this G-string outside. Please wash it, and then I will put it back outside.
Typical Tuesday crowd. Everybody wants to grab it, but nobody wants to pay for it. The worst part is I keep getting aroused. How long before the dance boners go away? You can still get erections? You're straight? I don't know if I want to be here, Roger. Come on, a little wang will cheer you right up. So your mulch business is going under. It's not the end of the world. Yeah, it just means my dad was right. Are you supposed to be pregnant or fat? Eight months Pragers. They don't make you buy the two drink minimum when you're knocked up, snuck in my own. This is a party ball. Ah, perfect pour. That, however, was urine I just drank. I'm starting to get the very bad feeling that none of these boys are gonna go full pickle tonight. Okay, ladies, open up your purses and show some love for a real Renaissance man, Michael Dangolo! Oh my god. I know, look at that meat! Trench me for a twain! Roger, that's my dad! Stan? Ooh. Bailey, this isn't how I wanted you to find out, but your daddy is a brilliant painter. Dad, is this where all the dry cleaning money was coming from? No wonder it was all in crumpled ones. You are such a liar. Haley, wait. Hang on, I paid for a three-song dance. Not now, Roger. Vic? Hey, Shelly. Hi, Victor. Listen, your stallion here is trying to run out on his dance. Vic, listen. You listen. Shelly was a dancer here for three years. Now she's family. You keep her happy. <sighs> No, no. Lean forward and look back. That's what I like. And make it rain, make it rain, make it... And look at me like you're a virgin. Oh, Tanqueray, you leaving? Yeah, I'm gonna try and get in Playboy. I've got a lot of good short stories. This suitcase is filled with science fiction. I'm sorry my father messed with your life with his stupid advice. I am so pissed at him. Hey, at least he's taking an interest in you. More than my dad ever did. And besides, he can be pretty smart sometimes. He was right about putting a banana in me. Well, goodbye. Did that girl just leave? I think she stole my jewelry. Haley, I'm sorry. I didn't want to admit my dry cleaning business was a bad idea, and... Well, the truth is, you were right. You're 18. You don't need my advice anymore. Yeah, maybe I don't. But it's nice to know you care enough to offer it. The good silver's missing! I'm calling the police! Actually, I pawned it all to pay down my debt. <laughs> you know, nothing cheers you up like being in a pawn shop. Because chances are, you're going to see a Flintstones alarm clock. Out of my way! Steve, where are the strippers? I don't know! Hey, look who's back! Where are the girls? Oh, you missed them. They're gone. Aww. But here's a dirty G-string. Enjoy! <laughs> it's your dad's. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I made it rain, made it rain, I made it rain on them boys. <laughs> Not this time, Nancy boy. Wow, that was interesting. I also have My Giant with Billy Crystal. Oh, God, no, no. 
Well, we almost have enough signatures thanks to Quahog's gay district. Lois, how'd you like to be signature number 